That's right, you need to pay to report players in the hive. But they have a super great reason for doing this, and I'm going to explain all of that in this video. Okay, so pretty much if you don't already know, you need to have hive plus rank on the hive server to be able to report players, which in fact does cost money. But there's a reason for this. So is the hive just trying to make more money off of people wanting to get hackers banned? Do you have to pay $10 to get hackers banned? No, they actually have a smart reason for doing this. Reporting players in the hive is in testing phase, as they said on their server. This is going to probably change in the future, and everyone's going to be able to use the report players option when it's out of testing and it's available to the public. But I'm actually hoping that they don't do that, and here's why. Pretty much the reason they made it so you need Hive Plus to report players is so that you cannot make alt accounts on the Hive and then just report players over and over again. Because the Hive staff team is going to have to look over each and every one of those reports, and it's so easy to make another account. But what's not easy is to get Hive Plus on all of those accounts. So, would I suggest getting Hive Plus if you don't have it just to report players? Well, my answer is no, because there are already people that do have Hive Plus that are probably going to report that player for you. As I mentioned in my last video, if you're going to report players, also report them on the Discord server. The Hive staff is actually not going to be looking at most of the reports, because like I said earlier, people are going to abuse the fact that this report setting exists, which I don't encourage you to do, because it might mean that they remove it. Anyways, that's going to do it for this video. See you guys later.